Hello guys, Lucas GG Pass, and today on FIFA 13 player reviews, we have Paolo Cannavaro. Uh, he's discard price on all consoles, so he's like 11, 12k. Key stats here: 89 interceptions, brilliant. 88 stand tackle, 84 slide tackle. He's also got 86 shot power, the leader trait, and the long passing trait, which is good for a centre back. Uh, he's six foot one. He's got low attack work rate and high defence work rate. Here is in-game stats. Um, obviously, not that good shooting ones. Although I was surprised. Yes, I think he had 75 long shots with 86 shot power. I mean that's pretty pretty nice for a centre back, and he got the long passing trait, so his passing's decent as well. Now, um, obviously it's Paolo Cannavaro, not um, Fabio Cannavaro, which is a shame that uh, Fabio's not in the game when well, he's retired, isn't he? But uh, yeah, this guy plays like he is in real life. He's got brilliant stand tackles, as you can tell by his stats, and his he, he just puts his body on the line there. He he really is like an Typical robust Italian defender putting his body on the line makes really good slide tackles. You see, when he does a uh, slide tackle, he can run with the ball, he's comfortable with the ball, and he can make a good pass. Two brilliant tackles here, absolutely flattening Fellaini. I actually quite liked having it having in there. Um, six foot one, so he's quite tall, and uh, he's got decent heading. He's he's not amazingly strong, but he's still you know strong enough. His interceptions are you know really good and that's probably what sometimes makes up for his lack of pace I mean he, you know he's got pace in the 50s it's not that good which means he does get outpaced but if he doesn't get outpaced you, you basically got the ball back and you know he's very comfortable on the ball which is really good um, he is an aggressive player so you're gonna go flying into those slide tackles but um, as you can see he makes some key tackles and it's good to have a player like that in the team because um, you know, defending these days, you need to have someone like that there. I didn't get to score with him. He hit the post with a header. That's the only chance I had really with him. But his positioning as a defender is awesome, and I I really did like having him there. So his strengths, obviously, his tackling, interceptions are really good, and he's a uh, tall six foot one. He's got decent strength on him. We can see he's slow, and he's overly aggressive sometimes, which means he could give away fouls. So I'll give him a 7.5 out of 10 rating. I would put him in my starting team. But we happen to be blessed with uh, Okapana and Gambarini. So I probably wouldn't. But um, he's worth a go. And he, would, he wouldn't be a bad middle player in a, a 3 or 5 of the back defence.